That's what Look we came that. for. Bro, it's big, bro. It's big. Woo. Stop. Yeah, baby! Dude, <laughs> we should probably anchor up right out there. What's up, guys? This is Captain Tyler. And I got a little special short video for you today. I want to show everybody an awesome way that I've figured out how to keep your fish fresh for longer periods of time. Um, I don't know about you, but I love eating my fish fresh. I eat a lot of fish and I've found a way to prolong uh, the fish's freshness without freezing it. So here's sushi. Sushi, what do you have to say about that? He shouldn't be on the counter. Get, 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 get down. Get down. Get down. Okay. So, here's the fridge. A little bit of a mess here. But, see in the corner of the fridge, you'll see uh, the, the vent there. That's where all the Freon or whatever cooling stuff comes out of the fridge. And so that's the coldest part of your fridge, right in that corner. Okay, and I set my fridge temperature to the coldest setting. So set your fridge temperature to the coldest setting. Here's some lobster and hogfish. But here is some mahi-mahi. And what I do is, th this mahi's been in here for at least a week. And I guarantee you it's still good. So here's why. I got it in a, in a pan, like a baking pan. And this ice has been in here the whole time and it never melted. So it must be like 31 degrees in there, just enough to keep the ice frozen and the fish, as you can tell, it's not fully frozen, but it is very close to freezing temperature. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you here when I take it out. There's the fish. So, not sure if you can tell, but it's very stiff because it's close to frozen. So this fish is ice cold. If you can see over here, it's like kind of frosty. Um, not, not fully frozen, but like this piece here, like it's still soft, but it is icy. So it's very, very close to being frozen. Not all the way and fresh as if you just caught it. And this fish is a week old. It's been in the fridge for a week, maybe longer. But because it's on that ice, that mahi is going to taste like we caught it the day of. Um, so yeah, take your fish, stick it in a baking pan or, or a bowl or something on with ice and get it in that corner of your fridge. Set it to a coldest temperature and uh, you got fresh fish for a long time. Um, that's pretty much it guys. Uh, yeah, and because the fish is icy, it'll defrost. Like you, you throw it right in a pan or right in the oven, it'll, it'll cook perfectly. Um, you know, it's a lot easier than dealing with a frozen piece of fish because you got to defrost it and worry about the middle not being cooked and blah, blah, blah. So that's it for you today. We will catch you on the next episode. Good luck on the water. Sushi, get, get down. Get down. Get down. Get down. <laughs>